Almost there. Just a little farther north and we'll be at the shrine. The landscape's gotten rockier. We're near Brodia. It's all mountains up there. I'm seeing fewer villages as well. Makes this a good place to hide an emblem ring, I suppose. Yeah. The closer you are to the Brodian border, the colder and quieter it gets. Look. Not a soul in sight. You're right. There's no one around. Except her. Oh! Take a little look around. Wait for it. I wonder what she's doing here. <laughs> she's crying. Oh, well, doesn't that break the heart? I'd better help. I am her prince, after all. I won't stand by when my people are suffering. Alfred, wait! Oh, what a scrape I'm in. Hey there. Huh? What's the matter? Something I can help with? <gasps> Z Z I knew we'd startle you. Sorry for popping up out of nowhere and... Zappy! You came just in time. I'm saved. Uh... I lost something earlier and there was nobody around to help, so I got real stressed out. Oh, right. I skipped over the niceties. You can call me Yunaka. Hiya, Papaya. Hiya, Papaya? Huh. I've never heard that one before. Anyway, what did you lose, Yunaka? It's a little round ring. Kind of shiny with a hole in the middle. Oh, and it talks for some reason. Come again? Yeah, I figured you wouldn't believe me. I believe you. It might be an emblem ring. Please, go on. What did it say? Hmm. Well, if I remember right, it asked me to take it to the Divine Dragon. To me? Is that... Did you... Uh, are you saying you're the Divine Dragon? Yes, I am. I'm sorry I didn't mention it sooner. I'm the Divine Dragon. And now that we're doing introductions, I'm Alfred, the Prince of Firenay. Holy broccoli! Why didn't you lead with that? I think I just had a heart attack. Nope, false alarm. Phew. I'm so sorry. I never meant to impact your health. Yunaka, how did you find the ring? I was walking along the border, minding my own business, when I heard a woman's voice. Help me. I'm right here. I'm by your foot. Huh. You're quite the performer. Anyway, I picked up the ring and she said, Take me to the Divine Dragon. But at that point, I had no idea where the Divine Dragon was, so I told her I couldn't help. She knew the way, though. Told me to start heading for the capital of Firenay. Oh, that's good advice. The quickest way to get to Lethos is through the capital. But on the way, I was attacked by bandits and ran off full speed. And now the ring's gone. I must have dropped it somewhere. Woe is me. Sniffle, sniffle. But now that you're here, you're gonna help me find it, right? Right? After hearing her story, this definitely sounds like an emblem ring. Probably the ring of the Dawn Maiden. But that means someone took it from the shrine. Or it could be another emblem ring. We'll just have to find it and see for ourselves. All right, Yunaka. We'll help you. Golly, that's great news. She'll be so happy if you're the one who finds her. Let's start by retracing your steps. No sign of the ring so far. Maybe somebody got to it before we did. Yeah, everyone's combing the area. If it was lying around, we would have found it by now. You're sure you didn't lose it before the bandits attacked? I had it on me when I passed through that ghost town over there. Huh? What is it? It looks like the town's overrun with bandits. What? How can you tell? I'll bet these are the same chumps who ambushed me earlier. Let's take a closer look. They've taken over the town. These are the bandits I ran into earlier. No doubt about it. 
And that means one of them's got... Aha! Right there. You see it? Yeah, a burly guy with something glinting in his hand. That's gotta be our missing ring. What do you think, Divine One? Is it an emblem ring? Hmm. He's too far. I really can't say. You must have great eyesight, Yunaka. Yeah, I have a killer's eyes. What was that? Killer eyes! I've got killer eyes! You know, they're great at seeing stuff. If you ever need something looked at real good, I'm your gal! <laughs> anyway, what's the plan now? We've got two problems that need solving. A stolen ring and a town full of bandits. The ring's our first priority, but we can't leave them unchecked. We'll only attract attention if we all charge in at once. I say we split up. You know, send in a small group to recover the ring. Nice and stealthy. All right. Okay then. Come on, Divine One. You're with me. Dokes. If we go through here, I bet we can sneak up on that guy with the ring. Slipping through a side passage? Smart thinking, Yunaka.
pitch black out here. How can we fight them if we can't even see them? Don't worry, Divine One. That's what I'm here for. My eyesight's so sharp, I can spot baddies even when it's dark or foggy. Till you get your hands on a torch, at least. Then you'll see as well as I can. Taken by surprise. Good idea. Please take me to the Divine Dragon. <laughs> this looks pretty pricey. This will net me a nice lump of gold. The boss doesn't need to know about it. <laughs> oh dear. You can't even hear me, can you? I hear her. That's the voice from before. That's definitely an emblem ring. Yunaka, will you help me get it back? Of course, you weirdo! That's why we're here! Right. Well, thank you. You know, now that I hear her, your impression was incredibly accurate. <laughs> Stop! You're gonna make me blush! Got the ring. Heal us, emblem of dawn. I am Emblem Micaiah. I sense the future shifting. Now, victory lies ahead! Ah, so it is the Ring of the Dawn Maiden. Yunaka, I entrust this ring to you. Me? Uh, but I... She belongs with you. All I ask is that in return, you help us defeat these bandits. Will you join with Emblem Micaiah? Yeah, okay. I won't let you down. I'm listening. For peace. I'm ready. As your steward. This isn't so bad. I'll do my best. Yeah! Me? Okay!
As your steward. Looks like we got us some uninvited guests. Snuff the lights, you lot. You got it. like our cover's blown. They're snuffing the torches. Don't sweat it. We can relight them as we go. Yunaka, let me show you how to use staves. week. I'm getting hungry. My hero! Beautiful while you lasted.
Whatever you need. With my magic, you may illuminate even the darkest of places. Lend me your strength! I cannot afford to lose. I live to fight again. Why, thank you. You were beautiful while you lasted. What a lovely scene. This is what I trained for.
I cannot afford to lose. Look what you made me do. Ah! Hope is on our side. I thank you. I live to fight again.
Nice. A right and proper end. Train for. I am the 32nd steward of the dragon. That helps. Engage! A little late to be saving the day. We killed off the villagers ages ago. <laughs> Fate has brought us here. <laughs> <laughs> ah! I cannot afford to lose.
think this is justice, huh? <laughs> That's the last of the bandits. You've been a huge help, Yunaka. If not for you, we'd be scratching our heads in an empty shrine right about now. I can't thank you enough. It was nothing, really. I wonder who took it from the shrine in the first place. It must have been those bandits, right? Uh, well... What's the matter? I have a... uh, confession. The thing is... I didn't find the ring. I stole it. Huh? I was strapped for money, and when I saw the shrine, I figured it might have valuables. I went inside, heard Micaiah's voice, and... Pow! There's the ring, staring right at me. I was just looking to make a quick bundle of dough. I I'm sorry. I see. When I learned that you two were royalty, I panicked and... Kinda... well... lied. Really, I'm no different from those bandits. I'll accept whatever punishment you give me. Hold on. You were planning to sell the ring? Yeah. Well then, why didn't you? You could have run for the hills as soon as the Divine Dragon handed it to you. We're useless in the dark. Would have been easy to give us the slip. But instead, you stuck around and risked your neck for us. Why? Well, because of Micaiah. When she started talking to me, I got this feeling that I just couldn't shake. I felt like... like I had to help her get to the Divine Dragon. Yunaka has shown me nothing but kindness. Fighting by her side, I saw a bright path ahead. When I sensed Sombron's return, I called out in the dark. It was she who answered. I am to blame for entangling her in all this. Yunaka has done nothing wrong. I hear you, but she did lie to us. As Prince, I'm not supposed to let that go without some sort of punishment. Lay it on me. I can handle it. How about joining our forces? Say, what now? We're on a journey to collect the Emblem Rings and defeat the Fell Dragon. I know it's a lot to ask, but will you pledge yourself to our cause? What do you think, Alfred? A fitting punishment? <laughs> I love it! Our army is pretty lean, so adding a new recruit makes a lot of sense. And Yunaka clearly has raw talent. She could be a real asset. I won't let you down. Thank you. Both of you. Don't mention it. And Yunaka, allow me to be the first to say, Haya Papaya. Uh... <laughs> Haya Papaya back at ya, Divine One. With that settled, let's hurry onward. We've got to cross into Brodia, right? Yes. Mother sent a letter to the Brodian king when we left the castle. He should be expecting us. Good. The Kingdom of Might. I'm curious to see what it's like there.
हाँ Amazing. Consider this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Consider this. You're the girl I met in Flora Mill Town. Vale, wasn't it? Oh, what a coincidence finding you here. I'm glad to see you again. You left so abruptly last time. It really caught me off guard. Do you live around here? No, I'm just passing through. Well, looking for someone, really. Who are you looking for? A person I must talk to again no matter what. My sibling. You were separated then. I'm sorry. It's painful to be apart from one's family. Do you have any idea where to look? None. I don't even know what face to look for. We've been apart since I was very young. But they did give me something long ago. This. What a pretty stone. It's my good luck charm. I know that as long as I have this... We'll be reunited someday. I'm sure you will. But don't forget to take care of yourself. Look, your leg's wounded. This kind of thing happens all the time. It looks pretty deep. There, that ought to hold for a while. You. You're quite kind to help a complete stranger like me. You're not a stranger. You saved my life, remember? That makes us friends, as far as I'm concerned. And friends help each other. Friends? <laughs> Should I not have said that? No, no. I'm just so happy to have someone I can call a friend. It's like a dream. I can't recall the last time I was treated with such kindness. What do you mean by that? I'm sorry, but I have to go. Are you sure? Thank you for the bandage. Hope to see you again. There she goes. See you around, Vale.
Divine One, we discovered this mysterious bracelet in Southern Firinae. There appear to be more of them enshrined on the islands off the coast. We should investigate. There's an emblem inside this bracelet, all right. The presence inside is complicated, but I think I have the invocation. Lead us, emblem of rivals. Finally, we're free. I am Emblem Edelgard. Pleased to meet you. I am Emblem Dimitri. I guess that makes me Emblem Claude. Hi there. That must have been a crowded bracelet. Sorry, I should introduce myself. I'm the Divine Dragon. You're obviously not from Elios. May I ask what you're doing here? Until recently, we were the guardians of another world. It seems we were moved somehow. I get the feeling you've come to give me some sort of test. No need for that. You were able to summon us. That is enough. And your timing is excellent. We were just growing weary of each other's conversation. Speak for yourself. I thought Dimitri's stories were getting better with every telling. Yes, the sarcastic interruptions kept increasing too. Coincidence, I'm sure. You three all seem to be... really comfortable with each other. Appearances can be deceiving. Really, Edelgard? She's kidding. You can tell because her face looks exactly the same as when she's serious. <laughs> we have always been in competition. It will be refreshing to join forces. I should explain. We were all students at the Officer's Academy, but we led different houses. That's what you meant by competition. Yes. We only truly came together for special events, like the Battle of the Eagle and Lion. A traditional mock battle between the houses, to celebrate one another's strengths. The real celebration was afterward. Our festivities got rather exuberant that night. Dimitri looks pretty straight-laced, but don't let him fool you. Between you and me, he's like a force of destruction at a party. I'm surprised they didn't expel his whole house for those shenanigans. <laughs> Must have been quite a night. You only just met him, so you can't tell if he's joking. Just ignore half of everything he says. Come on, be fair. At least a third of what I say is worth hearing. You do know a third is less than half, right? Let me say it formally. Our power is at your disposal. Please make the most of it. Victory will be ours. Have no fear. We are here to help. And if these two and their conventional tactics fail, maybe I'll show you a few tricks. That's all very reassuring. Thank you. I'll do my best to help the three of you work together. Edelgard! We shall win!
Marth, let's go! Edelgard! Count on me! Marth! Understood! Edelgard! We shall win!
Agreed. There you are! Ready for a workout? What'll it be? How hard do you want to go? What'll it be? How hard do you want to go? Perfect! Looking good! You've got this! Looking good! You've got this! Perfect! You've got this! Perfect! You've got this! Keep it up! Looking good! Perfect! You've got this! Nice! Keep it up! Nice! Keep it up! Nice! Great job! I'm so proud! Let's do this again sometime. There you are! Re That's right. That's true. How do you do? Welcome! Welcome!
One moment while I prepare your order. Now to business. This should be simple enough. I've prepared a first-rate meal. A solid meal to build solid muscles. A hearty meal. Tastefully presented. I prepared a bit extra for you to take with you. Well, hey there! Here you go! Take care! Mysterious wanderer, Yunaka! Clan, 33rd steward of the Divine Dragon! I lost. Hey! I actually won! This should be a fun workout. Shall we have a cup of tea afterward? <laughs> you dare? <laughs> <Ha -ya! laughs> you cut me down most effectively. My muscles deserve a treat after that.
<laughs> this should be a picturesque match. Hi there. I'm Jean, a doctor in training. It's been an honor sparring with you. I always do my best. Now and in the matches to come. You look tough! I'd better be careful! I am Micaiah. It's a pleasure. I need more training, I suppose. Hey! I actually won! Now that I've turned over a new leaf, I intend to devote myself entirely to you, Micaiah. No need for any of that, Yunaka. I'm glad you were the one to find me. Etier here, busting in once again. I'm Claude. Take it easy on me, maybe? Not bad! Yeah! He can't have bested me. My muscles deserve a treat after that. You're an energetic sort, Etier. Seems like you're always out for a jog. Running invigorates me. Want to join me for the next one? has arrived I'm Dimitri let us grow strong together thanks for showing me what I still need to work on hey Claude we should have a little strength competition best way to become fast friends I'm all for making friends, but a contest like that wouldn't be fair. How about a board game? I am Chloe, Royal Knight of Firenay. My name is Dimitri.
Shall we spar? What? It seems I still have training to do. I always do my best. Now and in the matches to come. I brought you some folk food made of fish eyes, but I'm sorry. You can't actually eat, can you? No need to apologize. Watching you enjoy a meal is gratifying in itself. Please, dig in.
Well, hey there! Here you go! Here you go. Take care. 